up in the mountains out here. About to do a uh, quick little off-road run um, up into a little mountain pass, do some camping. This is Ben. Welcome to my channel and welcome to Alaska. Rolling with the Land Cruiser. Got Danny and his forerunner. Got Ryan with his forerunner. We got Kai over here getting swarmed by mosquitoes. <laughs> Hell yeah, bro. We roll out. It's pretty buggy. Nice weather, though. So we are making the ascent, climbing up here. Pretty steep climb, but it's not super long, so be up there shortly. Normally I'd have the windows down, but super dusty out today, so just kind of rolling with the windows up, air conditioning on. Crazy beautiful day today, I mean the views are just amazing. Super clear, not a lot of rain recently, probably get some rain this week. Comes Kai coming through. It's getting all flexed out in the old forerunner. We're out here stopping for lunch. Super, super scenic spot. Not far into the trail. Scott, what are you doing over there? through here. Oh, that's a rock. That's another rock. All right. Going through here. It's pretty narrow. Little uh, pass here. Some water running through it. Really, really pretty area. But I think if we had anything bigger, I don't know if we would fit because uh, I can barely fit through right here. It's definitely a narrow spot. See if I can get out and film, film the crew. I'm gonna film you guys here, hold on. Here comes Kai. Hopefully he doesn't pop a tire. <laughs> I think since he's been in Alaska, he's, or maybe on the, his road trip to Alaska. I think it was on his road trip to Alaska and including Alaska, he's popped like three tires. So we'll see. I'm sure it'll be fun. Comes the Danny, just bouncing on through. Look at that! Look at that handsome man. <laughs> we are just cruising down this little mountain pass. If I can get in focus there, it's cruising down here. A lot of streams that just kind of overlap with the trail, um, but it is a absolutely gorgeous day out today. So going down this right now. I'm in low range, first gear, no brakes, it's kind of yeah, steep, <laughs> but uh, not bad at all. This thing just is crazy low now that it's re-geared. 488s are definitely the move. Comes Kai. The Daniel. Mishka over here is in the dirty dog seat. Had to jump out of the car, of course. Hey, 
And now, since I took a pee, Mishka has made my seat the dirty dog seat as well. Isn't that nice, bud? Don't we love that? Stop real quick, take in some of the scenery. Guys, all the way out there. He's running. He's like a little oh, he's dot. Scouting. He's got a scout. <laughs> he's scouting. Scout the shots. Just one looks like. Side by side. Yeah, I mean this is definitely an easy. Mobbing down. Oh yeah, he's got an ATV behind him. Going up a fairly steep hill here. Just uh, open diffs right now. But uh, second gear low, just kind of got my foot gently on the pedal, making our way up nice and slow. Maybe could have put my rear locker on if I wanted a little extra push, but she's making it up fine. Hopefully nobody's coming around the corner. Me. Dog. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing, bud? Get back in there, dirty dog. Dirty dog. Get back in there. Kind of working his way through the river there. It's like one little rock you gotta kinda maneuver around and then cut it nice through there. Good job. Comes a wild Daniel. Kinda putting the slider on that rock. Putting that slider to work. Dipping in. Lovely. I'm bouncing around. And then here, I'll just have to navigate between those things. Good to go. Nice. Yeah, Danny avoided it somehow.
kind of rolling through here. It's a cool old mine out here. People work here, I don't know, what, like three people maybe work here. Something like that. Little spot. Old shacks. Last time I was here at least, there was just like a few old dudes out here just working the mine, drinking beers, doing Alaska stuff. Can uh, give a big old shout out to the miners for giving us a lot of these off-road trails. A ton of the off-road trails that we run out here are current or old uh, mining trails. So some of them you can't go to the mines and some of them you can just drive by them. But it's definitely super cool because, I mean, otherwise it would be probably difficult to get back here. Right now we're just looking for a camp spot. There's some camp spots back there, but it had a little steep drop off, so we're probably just uh, gonna keep going. Hopefully find a nice little campsite by water. This is like the one spot where I put it into high gear. Most of the trails out here, uh, it's pretty slow going a lot of the time. You don't really have to haul. If you have like a side-by-side -side or something like that, those guys like to haul, but a lot of them you can kind of just keep uh, keep it in low gear, just kind of meander around. It's kind of the style of off-roading that I like anyways. I'm not really trying to go high speed or anything. That's how things get broken. Also, uh, Land Cruiser, weight, torsion bars, suspension in the front doesn't make for a nice high-speed off-road experience. Mishka? What you doing, dude? What's going on? What's going on? Absolutely gorgeous day. Crazy good weather out here. Super beautiful. Beach guy, you having fun? Enjoying the good weather, bud? It's like, Dad, I want to run around all over the place and go crazy. I'll be in camp eventually, son. All right, so update. We're uh, trying to go up this way, but uh, being the lead rig here, I have the biggest rig, and it was just a little bit of maneuvering, so I didn't, we didn't really feel like doing that, because if I'm maneuvering, then they're probably just gonna have to maneuver even more. So, uh, we're just coming back down this rocky creek here. And hopefully I don't smash nothing too bad on a rock. But uh, I've just been taking it nice and slow. It is fun having the rear locker though, going through a lot of this. It just kind of pushes me through. There's maybe a couple spots I could have put my front locker on, but whatever, it's not the end of the world. So we're just kind of slowly getting back. I had to do a one million point turn to get out of here. Now I'm hung up on a rock because I'm narrating and not driving. Right, here we go. Yeah. It's not too bad, but there's like a steep, steep little hill climb that I didn't really feel like making everybody go through. I didn't really feel like doing it myself. So, uh, here we are, coming back. It is beautiful back here, so that's cool. But, uh, yeah, we'll just find another camping spot. So we're gonna bail on finding a camp spot here. We came across a couple good ones, but not really what we're looking for with how many vehicles we have. Um, so we're gonna double back and, uh, just camp along our way back home.
finally found a camp spot that can fit all of us. Picking some fur rib, some Brussels sprouts. I like that view, Mishka. Mishka, I like that view. Not impressed. Probably can't see. dinner got the camping spot going fires going and it's about midnight here the mountains off there in the distance got the swag right here I'm going to bed thanks for watching